Hey everybody, welcome back to Magic Orthodoxy. My name is David and this is a Magic Review. Hey, today we're gonna to look at Unlink from Jordan Victoria. What is Unlink? Uh, Unlink is a card utility. It's not really a magic trick so much as you're getting a magical device. And from that device, you'll be able to do uh, all of the tricks that are on this DVD. Plus, you'll be able to use it to create your own tricks. What kind of tricks? Uh, you're gonna get one called Vanish and Appear. It's a sandwich effect where you take a selected card, place it between two others, and then in a Vanish, it disappears. There's another one on there called Double Voyage. It's another sandwich effect where you place a selected card between two cards and an advantage disappears and it appears in the middle of your deck. And then you can do it one more time. It's crazy. Uh, there's another trick on there called Color Change. Uh, it's another sandwich effect where basically you take, let's say a red ace and put it between two kings. And then when you snap your fingers, the red ace changes into a black ace. It's crazy. You wanna see what it looks like? This is Unlink. All right, so that was Unlinked from Jordan Victoria. Uh, if you don't know Jordan Victoria, he did uh, Change Is, he did Spectrum, he did Around, he did In the Air. This was put out from PCTC Production. All right, so what did I like about it? Hey, it's a neat utility. You can use it in a lot of different ways and it's gonna allow you to create some really impossible looking magic. Uh, so a few questions we always ask about all of our products, the first of which is, what's in the box? Hey, what's in the box? You're gonna get a DVD and you're gonna get a gimmick and you're gonna get some material to repair your gimmick, all right? Um, is it what I thought? I, when I saw the trailer, I had no idea what to think. You don't know if you're watching sleight of hand or a gimmick or a sleight of hand and a gimmick or some sort of weird voodoo. I mean, it, I had no idea what to think and it certainly wasn't anything what I thought. I had never seen a gimmick quite like this. Now, I will say that I've seen an effect like this and Jordan Victoria even pays credit where credit is due. He was inspired by the effect Twisted from Eric Jones, which is actually a Mark Mason gimmick. However, the two gimmicks are not similar. All right, so how are the angles? The angles on this are good. Uh, they're really clean. There's no way uh, your spectator should ever be able to see the gimmick in action. It's very clean and it's very well hidden. Can it be inspected? Absolutely not. That's what we say around here all the time, is it's a gimmick, it's a gaff, and gimmicks are not supposed to be inspected. How is the overall quality and production value of the DVD? Here's where I take some issue. Um, I think there's a language barrier uh, with Jordan Victoria in his teaching, so on the DVD there's absolutely no words. Everything's done with subtitle. Um, the lighting in the situation is also a little low. It doesn't hurt anything, but it's just noticeable. Um, there is a some flashing that he does even as a teacher, so he's, his angles are kind of wrong and he's showing you the effect um, just from the wrong viewpoint, and so you do see some flashing in it as well. Um, also, in lieu of words, uh, you get to listen to kind of some cheesy disco music, which kind of gets annoying after a while, and I turned my volume down when I was watching it. Uh, there's even some spelling issues, even in the subtitles. So, again, I think that was mostly due to a language barrier. It doesn't affect the quality of the gimmick or the quality of the magic that you're getting with this DVD. Is the gimmick well made? It is really well made. I can't imagine it being made any better. I will say that the reason why you're getting materials to repair the gimmick is there's probably a chance that the gimmick will wear over time. It's not one of those gimmicks that's gonna last forever and you will need to do some uh, arts and crafts on it over time, I'm sure. How much practice does this require? Uh, most of the practice on this is gonna be in timing and in just memorizing the routine. Uh, there isn't so much a lot of practice with using the gimmick. The gimmick is pretty self-working uh, in, in and of itself. 
And so again, like I said, it's going to be timing on your part, uh, you getting familiar with the gimmick and just learning uh, when to say go. And, uh, and, and just learning some of the routines that are included on the DVD. So how much setup and reset is there? Um, there's almost none. Uh, setup, there's a little bit. Uh, your spectator's not gonna be able to watch you get into this effect. Um, you're definitely gonna have to do some pre-setup before uh, the routine, but afterwards, cleanup is really fast and you'll be set up again in no time. What are some positives to this? Uh, there's a really cool tip section at the end uh, where he goes over a lot of ins and outs and things that you might wanna need to know. Uh, there's even a bonus move section at the end that covers slights. Uh, and that's really gr great that he uh, includes that. So just in case you're a beginner magician and you don't know how to do some of the slights that are involved, he covers all of that at the end. Okay, so some negatives. Hey, like we say around here, there's negatives to everything. These are just my negatives. They don't have to be your negatives. Uh, the thing with the, the gimmick is, it's always gonna be the same card, right? Because it's a, it's a face card. And so um, that, that has to be seen in the, in the, in the effect. And, and so uh, you're never gonna wanna do uh, this effect probably for the same person. Even if you're doing one of the other effects on the DVD, they're gonna recognize that you're using the same card all the time. I would just be wary of spectator management and just and, and realizing that you can't use uh, this, this tool, you know, over and over again with the same person. Like if you always do tricks for your mom, this is probably not <laughs> the trick you wanna show her again and again and again. because She's gonna notice that your tool is visible each time. And so again, like I said, it, it's, um, it's marketed as a tool, it is a tool, but I still think I would only use it one time in a routine or one time for a particular audience member. Is it worth your money? Hey, it's 30 bucks. It's $30 and you're getting the DVD and you're getting the gimmick. It's a well-made gimmick, like I said, but you're only getting one. And so uh, it's, kind of in the, it's kind of in that pocket, you know? You kind of have to think whether the effects on uh, the DVD are the kind of effects that you do and it is the kind of magic that you do and kind of weigh it from there. I don't think you're being cheated, absolutely, but uh, I think you'll need to decide for yourself. All right, so who would like this? Hey, anybody that likes self-working magic, I think would love this, uh, especially self-working magic that looks impossible. I mean, this is a great little utility that can create some impossible looking effects. I mean, people will think that you're just like an expert card magician uh, with something like this. And like I said, it's completely self-working. It's great for uh, intermediate and uh, beginning magicians as well. All right, so that was Unlinked from Jordan Victoria. If you'd like to purchase your own, you can find it at one of your favorite Murphy's Magic suppliers.